Hi and welcome to this uh, logo programming tutorial. In this tutorial I'm going to teach you guys today how to set your own variables. Uh, what I'm doing right now is just to increase uh, the size of my pen and now we also increase the size of the label so that you can see what I'm doing clearly maybe I should make it about 28 so that you guys can see it okay um, it's more or less you're making up your own word or making up your own variable or you can say making up your own command so let me show you an example of what I'm talking about right here I say repeat repeat for okay now I come here and I say forward forward let's make that 100 and write 90 if you look at this command that I've put underneath here you see this repeat 4 is I'm actually telling Toto to draw four times and FD 100 that actually means number of steps in each line then the last bit RT 90 that is how sharp to make the turn between each line that is what you see but supposing you don't want to use this you don't want to use you want to create your own variable which is what today's tutorial is about you click on e that all that is actually using the editor that is the editor right there let me see if I can change the font size of this editor to something a bit larger good I think that's good enough this is the logo editor so all you need to then do is instead of writing out those lines of code you can always say um, just enter the following in the ed editor define your own variable so I'm gonna call my variable square that is square okay that is the name of my variable press enter and you just enter exactly the same thing repeat repeat for F D make that under that again and repeat 90 you can see if you notice it's exactly the same lines of command that I typed in here that I enter in here the only different is I then define a variable or my own words that I'm going to use so the next thing you do is go to file save and exit remember this name save and exit once that is exit let, let me clear this screen just enter c s there to clear the screen and to now call the program that you've written in the editor all you need to do is enter square you see that Just call square and press enter. That is it. I clear the screen again. Just to demonstrate it one more time. Square. Press enter. Clear screen. Call my square. And enter. You see that guys? Now. You can even. Take it to the nearest. The next level. You can always say. Let's repeat this very square. Let's repeat this square. Enter the very square right there. And say, repeat this square. Write 10 times. That's another command. I'm actually talking to this my very square right there. So I've asked it to repeat it 10 times. Click on that. That is what you end up with. Can you guys see that? that is my square now I've made use of my very square okay you can even take it one more step further maybe 
let's say you want to change the color set PC define your color I don't know what that color is okay I've defined my color press enter now this very square let me change this to let's make that 72 72 and let's make this maybe 210 let's see what will happen can you you might not be able to see that but the colors have changed let me go for a red color let's change the pen color to red so that you guys can see it click on ok click on that and select can you see that guys you see the colors have, ch has changed and the, the design actually changed so that's how to use your own editor that's your own editor right here that's how to use your own editor and the other design can just be you can change the color let's change the color again to that's fine we already have blue click on that that's what you get um, you can always click on your reset right here click on reset and in this case I've actually enter repeat 36 times now I've added my square right there which is the command I defined earlier and right here I have I've added another FD 200 and to the right 300 let's execute this and see look at that guys can you see that move this down a little bit so with that very command this is what you end up with so you can always play around with this uh, method of uh, logo programming using the editor to define anything that you want or whatever name you want to call your system so i'm just going to call it uh, have a nice day for now